Hey guys, um, um, coming to you guys, like, man, it's like so much going on right now online and it's been really weighing heavy on my heart, so, um, I'm an expressive person, so, um, a lot of times for me, when I'm feeling hurt or, you know, I feel like things are heavy on my heart, I like to write and this is actually one of the first very unique times where I've written something and... I've actually wanted to share it. Um, you know, somewhat of an artist, but I am sensitive about my craft. So a lot of things I like to keep personal. Um, but today I just felt like, you know, I wanted to share this writing. And so, um, sit back and hear me out. <clears throat> I am so tired. We are all so tired. Is this it? Is this the American dream? Is this equality? Is this making America great again? When they go low, <laughs> we go high. I swear I'm trying, but I can't breathe from the sky. I'm sick of it. I am a good person and would give the clothes off my back. But the only thing that they can see is that my skin is black. You coward. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I said it. You cowards. You would rather fear me than help me, hate me than love me, kill me than embrace me. You refuse to see that you are me. Human, we are one in the same. respect they are killing us in these streets they are killing us and it is killing me I'm reaching out for help do not ignore me why why can't you see me I'm standing I'm right here in front of you I am your reflection I am a descendant of God, born into royalty. I am a queen. George Floyd, a king. Ahmaud Avery, a king. Eric Gardner, a king. Sandra Bland, a queen like me. Trayvon Martin, a king, you keep trying to break my spirit, but you forget that I have faith. So I refuse to accept your America as is. I want MLK's vision. And let's make America equal. Because it never was for people who look like me or you. So let's do what we can to come together as one. <laughs>